Sun's good? Yeah, you can climb. Uh, uh, isn't it the bigger trees that you can climb? No, 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 you can climb the smaller ones as well. I want to climb the smaller ones. <laughs> you can, but you're just too busy attacking. Yeah, there we go. There we are, we got it eventually. Look at, look at, look at that. Look at that. Where? Is that just crotch? Ow! Oh, uh, oh. <laughs> it's like, hug me! Okay, I don't want to hug you. Hug me. She loves me. She loves me. Yeah. She loves me. She loves me. She loves me. She loves me. I know, I'm a koala. I think we can turn these trees. It's quite good. Ow, 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 ow. Surely this hurts. <laughs> so, uh, straight to train? Or do we actually go off the islands with our Well, no, we could go straight to training. Now, around this island, you would find uh, three of Sora's friends. We've got Waka, 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 who we know from Final Fantasy X. Yep. Uh, I don't know where she, this one's from. And that, that's where the strategy guy comes in. I don't know where this girl's from. I, I... She is from a certain Final Fantasy uh, well, self, selfie. Uh, I think she's from Final Fantasy um, 8 or 9. Uh, Quote me if I'm wrong. I don't, I don't oh, know hang on. Final Fantasy 5... 6... Final Fantasy 8. Oh, she's... Oh, so... Final Fantasy 8, she, like, resides in. Uh, so, yeah. Final Fantasy... Two characters from Final Fantasy 10 and one from 8. The tech one. Oh uh, yeah, another one from Final Fantasy X is also, as we know, uh, in the Ameri how the Americans pronounce it, is Tidus. Yeah. Whereas us British, we like to call him Tidus. Because it sounds better. Uh, as you can see here, here he is training. Yeah. Oh, oh, there's the rope that we also have to get to Kyrie. We normally get told the to list anyway, but yeah. well, we since we're like pros, we're not going to talk to it yet. Yeah. Um, should we? Well, let's go. Uh, hey, talk Sora, to you feel lucky today? <laughs> feel lucky today? Hmm. Do, I, do we feel lucky today? Yeah. Uh. Actually, we're going to go save it first. Ah, oh, okay. Because then we're going to go straight to training. Run! Because then it comes the part where I, the Great Sedgehog, will teach you how to get the best out of all of your friends. And that's <laughs> so you can get the best EXP so you can level up. And somehow beat Riku. I think it's in here. Yes. If number serves correct. Yes. And if I change the camera angle with the L and R2 button. And here we are. You see. Oh, it's got a question mark. Is that confused? So it's like, what am I supposed yeah, to do? Yeah, what am I supposed to do? Uh, am I supposed to send you? Am I? Am I? Am I just. Okay, okay let's, let's, let's just get let's, it. Let's just save it. Uh, see, it auto the nice feature here, it automatically goes to the actual save file you've started on. Mm -hmm. which is yeah, it does that with many games, actually. But still, well, not all of them. Final Fantasy X, when I've played it, it doesn't go directly to the actual one. Ah. You actually have to select which one you save on. Ah, right. Which has, um, at one point, um, some guys set over saved one of my uh, very hard worked on data. And Son and of a... <laughs> yes, it was very annoying. I have deep rooted issues for that sort of thing. But we're not going to talk about that right now, so we're going to leave you guys, you know. <laughs> you don't love me! Is that. That's it. <laughs> okay, we're so far level 4. Bye. We're back! Hello! With Dark Cloud and Sedgehog! Sedgehog back here. And we're still playing Kingdom Hearts. Yeah, you know. Now, now in this walkthrough, we're going to be doing some training. So, yeah, um, we've already cut the, uh, we've already cut out the, um, the little type, the, the uh, what do we call it, trip thingy, cutscenes, cutscenes. That's it. Now, in this, uh, you're going to be hanging out with me for a little bit because I'm going to show you how you can get the uh, uh, best e EXP out of the fights with your friends. Giggity. Um, now this is the part of the game where you can train yourself by fighting your friends. Yeah. Now Jesus. selfie isn't very good for training, um, but, but we're going to beat her up anyway <laughs> because we're gentlemen. Yeah. <laughs> yes, real gentlemen cut up their friends with a wooden sword. But her her weapon is so annoying, and the fact that love hearts appear when she hits you is a very annoying dick move. Come on. 
Sean said I got hate to Ah, there we go. Tech. Oh, you tech. Got, you've got two techs. Uh, I think tech means teach. Or technique. Or technique. Oh, or whatever. I can't believe I lost. Yeah. Now, those little things you can easily gain more and more EXP. But Selfie isn't the one you should be training with. I just wanted to fight her just to, you know, I think show you. I think it's more worthwhile to face Waka and Titus. Exactly. But first, I'm, I'm going to do it by order of training, so... Selfie is the worst to train with. Next is Tidus. Yeah. I know that some of you may... Oh, Tidus, sorry. Whatever. Some of you, some of you may be saying, look, Tidus, he's awesome, you know. And um, you gain 2 XP from him, but the thing is, you can gain more EXP with Waka. Because he can block his attacks as well, which is an extra bonus, really. Yeah. You get, like, 2 yeah. technique from him when you block. Yeah. Oh, oh it doesn't look so good. Look at that little fish in the corner. Look at that little fish. Come on, you can do it. Go on. Murder him. There we go. Two. Now, when he attacks you, you can block him by attacking, and that'll gain you another one EXP. But like I said, um, the best um, friend to train with is Waka. And I'm going to show you why, because there's a special thing that Waka does. Uh, so he you... throws his Blitz Ball. Yeah. Yeah, his Blitz Ball is a pastime stop. that is... So, one of the best things is to not lock on, and just... Well, actually, yeah, it is yeah, to it is, lock on. Yeah, it, it is to lock on, because then when you counter... You can actually hit Just make sure not to let the balls hit Waka when you hit them back. Why? It knocks them out. No, you still need him alive, so that way you can gain EXP more quickly. Now you see, that technique he does there, we just got another 2 EXP. And trust me, it is annoying to try and block it at times if you don't know what you're doing. So that's why it's good to lock on to wa Waka. So that way you know where the attacks are coming from. See, look, this. Oh, uppercut! Nice. <clears throat> so you can actually just keep this going without actually trying to defeat him. Exactly. This is the best way to grow EXP. Oh, oh crap. Yeah, it, it does take a lot of health out of you, so do be careful when you're facing him. Yes, it's one of his powerfulest attacks and it takes quite a lot of health out of you. Oh, you just you just hit a it's, back a, it's okay. Hey, you recover quickly. Oh crap. Oh. Uh, <laughs> I kinda of find it funny when he gets hit in the head though. Oh whoops, that? <laughs> it's just... all about timing with Walker. And as you can see, he's constantly being dizzied by... Uh, it's okay, eventually he'll knock out of it. There we go. Uh, yeah. And then... I kind of find it funny that you're just making him look like an idiot. Here we go. What annoys me is his voice. <laughs> I got him. Uh, oh, I don't feel so good. Ah, oh, my head! You can, oh, he did. And we got him. And you got quite a few like oh, H um, experience really from that. Hurt. It may not be like huge amounts, but it's a very quick way. Yeah. So we're going to do a little montage for you, and uh, we're going to be doing some training. So please bear with us. It's a montage. <laughs> <laughs>